Hi, Dress Air Kitties, Wendy here. Today we're gonna draw Toadette from Super Mario. So let's get started. To draw cute Toadette, let's first start by drawing her eyes. So I'm gonna come right here and draw an oval. So I go up and down and around to create our oval. Then I'm gonna come right next to it, say about this wide, and draw another oval, just the same as the other side. There. So now I have my two ovals. I'm going to come to the top right here and draw a circle for a highlight and shade everything else in. And same thing over here. There. So now that our eyes in, let's draw her big smile. So right underneath the eyes, about right here, the center of the, each eye, about right here and here. I'm gonna give myself two points, which is easier. I'm gonna go ahead and just draw this big curve all the way across to my points. And then just cap it off. There, very happy, right? So then from there, let's go ahead and frame her face. So I'm going to say come down a little bit, just about like right here at the top of her eye. I'm going to come across, say about this wide. And same thing here, about right, about here. Same distance on the other side. And I'm just going to draw a bottom of a U to frame her face. So let's come down and we're just going to go around. Nice round curve. So I'll say about right here. I'm just going to give myself a point so I know where I'm going. With my curve. And so that's my center. And now that I'm to my center, I'm just going to go up on this side. So just play around with it. Sometimes you might want to come down. It's easier for your hand. Or turn your paper. Whatever helps for you to draw this curve. Now that we have that, let's go ahead and we're going to draw a curve on top. So. About right here, we're just going to draw a curve right over the eyes. And once again, I'm going to come to my center about right there and then come down. There. And then now that we're done with her face, let's draw her hair. So let's give yourself a point. So let's say about right here and right here, kind of like where the smile ends. I'll give myself two points. And from these two points, I'm going to draw this big uh, oval. <laughs> so let's go up, about right here, and we're just gonna draw this huge top. So once again, play around with it, see what's easier for you. You can go this way, or you can, you can find your center and come down. It's all up to you. But I'm going to just imagine this, I kind of want it this big. So I'll just say about, that's my center. So I'm just gonna give myself a point about right, let's just say about right here. I'll give myself a point so it's easier for my hand. And I'm just gonna draw a big curve coming down. So like I said, just play around with it. Whatever is easier for you to draw this big, curve right here and we're just going to bring it in and connect there. So we're going to do the same thing on the other side. So it's always harder on the other side because you kind of have to try to match the other side. So and then about right here, at least we know we're going to come back to here. So Bring this curve and just play around with it once again. And if you're too high or too low, just make your adjustments. So if you're using a pencil at home, then you can erase. There, something like that, nice and big. And then let's draw some details. Let's come to the side right here, very close. And we're just gonna draw a very slight curve, almost a straight line for some details. And same thing here. And we'll go straight for the spots there. And then we have this big round circle we need to draw at the top. So very, very close to the top. I'm going to come right here and draw, oops, sorry, and draw a big circle. So say about right there, I'm going to go ahead. Uh, 
about right there and then finish off my circle right here in the center. Now that we're done with all that, let's come back and draw her body. So I'm going to come about right, uh, about right here and I'm just going to draw a curve down. So it's basically like you're drawing toad, right? <laughs> And check out my video if you want to just draw a toad. But this is basically drawing him. Um, but with, we're going to put in some pigtails and to make her toe dead. So now that we have that curve, we're going to come back and say about right here. We're just going to go ahead and angle. So about here and here. Deep line and then let's come out. I'm just going to flare this line out and then um, about right here, I'm just going to stop and let's come back in here to draw the vest. So I'm going to come down and then about right here, I'm going to curve and connect. So same thing here, come down and then curve and connect. There. And then for some details, you come back in here and just follow your outside line. There. And then we're going to come in a little bit and then flare this part out. And here as well for her dress. So now they're about the same level. Let's go ahead and just connect it. Do a curve all the way across and then let's draw the bottom so let's come about right here and here and we're just going to go ahead and connect it with a shallow curve and then for the feet find your center go right here and come to the sides on both sides and right here let's work on this foot first just draw a curve and then right here we're going to round it off all right there and now we're just going to go ahead and connect there so same exact thing over here curve we're going to come back out here big curve and just connect there so notice it's just a little bit flatter towards the bottom now that we have that and let's draw her hands so we're going to bring this shoulder down and then we're just going to flare it out and we want her hands to be about right here. So let's bring this out. Bring, let's see here, we're just going to come right here and curve out and let's draw some fingers, simplify and then a thumb there. So same thing over here. And so it starts about here. And the thumb to so about right here. And once again, the fingers. And they go up a tiny bit and then connect there. Okay, so that is done. Now let's draw her pigtails to make her, uh, to finally make her toe dead. So we're gonna come right about here and we're gonna start a partial circle so let's say about right here we're gonna draw one big curve to about here and then there's a center circle so another one smaller and then a really big one and so I'm gonna come about right here and go around so that I don't I'm gonna try to Make it easier when they come out about right here so I'll hit the tip of the finger and make it messy. There. Okay, so now we have that. And then for some details, um, we'll put in a curve right here and then a circle in this area. There. So, same exact thing on this side. So I'm just going to drag some points across 
So it's just a little bit easier for me to figure out approximate, so about right here. And I'm gonna curve to that point, just like the other side, and then let's just keep going at this angle. So about right here, draw a smaller circle. And then one big one. And just make sure you're going all in the same angle. And one more. And bigger circle. <laughs> and pop it out about right here and connect. There. Okay, this one got a lot bigger, right? So you can always come back in here. Either make it smaller or bigger. Okay, now I'm just making a mess, but hopefully you get the idea. Okay, so then from there, let's do the same thing. We're gonna come right here with a curve and then a circle. Right about there. And that is pretty much it for my drawing of Toadette, except of course, I'm gonna put a heart right here to make her my draw so cute Toadette from Super Mario. I really hope I helped you draw her fun and easy today. And if I did, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new draw so cute videos. See you later.